How's it going, fellow commanders? Twisted Manifest here. Gonna be talking today about Dav's Hope. If you're working on engineering or you're looking for some parts that you are not able to find really out in the open or, for example, a medical container, very hard, in, well, at least in my sense, to find or track down, well, Dav's Hope is gonna be your hope. Let me show you what that's all about. Let's jump right into it, shall we? All right, so here we're going to be uh, we're be talking about Dav's Hope. Uh, before we get into anything, Dav's Hope, a lot of the stuff that you see here is mainly going to be for engineers. Now, I will be talking later on about engineers. There's still a lot that I personally don't have. Um, but you're going to find out that with engineers, you're going to need certain materials. So, for example, we have... Let's see... I don't have it uh, pinned, so mess a well for that one. Oh, no, I do. Here we go. So, for this one, you can see that you need, like, a chemical distillery, um, chemical manipulators, and also you're going to end up needing to get the original. You're going to need medical containers. Uh, now, medical containers can be found on any... Um, any type of cargo ship uh, that is going around the system, you decide to blow it up and be that type of guy. Or you can head on over to Dav's Hope and you can find a lot of the stuff that's in here and then some. So Dav's Hope is going to be found in a very easily pronounced Hades Sector DR-V space C2-23. Now if I was a good editor, I would put that on the screen for you right here in bigger letters than numbers which I might but what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to head over here and what I'd recommend doing have get yourself a fuel scoop and once you have that vectored in make sure you click on fastest route that's under our second tab here and then go on over to this bad boy click on map this might say something different like economy or whatnot. Make sure it's selected as star class and make sure only these first seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven are selected and apply to filter or apply to route. That way, every jump that you do is more than likely going to have a star that you can fuel up on. And you're also going to be going as fast or as far as your uh, frame shift drive allows. So once you're here, you're going to end up looking for where she at. So it's going to be planet A5. Now you can drop into a nav beacon and you can find out all the information here. But once you get to here, you can do a detailed surface scan if you'd like. Um, but once you are here, Dav's Hope will show up uh, for you so that you'll be able to lock onto it and attempt to do a planet land which I'm quite honestly not the best of which is why I started the video when I'm already here might have taken some whole damage not gonna lie but anyway um, also make sure when you're on your way here you have an SRV you're really gonna need that that's that little uh, buggy that you drive around on planets so once you land I wouldn't recommend bringing a big ship like an anaconda uh, but once you do land uh, you're going to end up in a nice little place that looks like this. Let's get a better view of it. You end up in a nice little place It's going to look like this. It's small. But what you're going to end up doing is you're going to be doing a circle around this. So you'll be starting right here. And you're going to be just going around in a circle. Now, as you'll see on the map that I... <clears throat> should be putting up right now of this area you'll see where each item might be located um, and while you're going around it also it's going to show you a path on what to do there's a data link there in the, in the start and you're going to go around the path that's shown on the map so let me show you what that looks like 
Let's get right into it. Let's deploy our scare. Make sure you turn that drive assist off because it is the bane of my existence. Make sure it's off. And uh, remember, if you're on, um, if you're on the computer, if you're on PC. It's kind of weird to drive an SRV. You gotta use E to accelerate. Takes a little bit getting used to. What I would do is uh, have your turret view up. Okay, let's take out a turret. There we go. All right. So we're gonna have our turret out. And what we're gonna do is, some people like to hit this last as like, this is their checkpoint. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit this. So you're gonna target it. And you're gonna hold down your right click or your target button. Make sure it's in view, unlike I just did. And then you'll get a story actually about Dav's Hope. There's a whole story behind it, each part of here uh, there's about four or five of them, I believe. We'll have little data links. If you're into that, you can uh, read about them. But as you're going, you'll find areas like this. Make sure your fuel scoop is down. Cargo scoop Our cargo scoop. And make sure you target what you want to pick up. Because if you don't, you'll just run right over it. Now, as you get used to this, you'll be able to run it a little bit quicker. I'm just kind of going slow so you can see everything. So there's something right there. Make sure that it's selected. And we'll continue our way. There's another one. Identity composites. And this will not take up any cargo space. This is all materials that'll go right into your uh, synthesizing area. Which I'll talk later about how you can make different ammos and things like that. Um, right from your ship. When you have certain materials. Well, basically, you're just going to go around here. Not crashing. If you're unsure of your driving, you can bring two of these with you. I bring one because... I don't plan on crashing too much. But these things are fickle and quite annoying. And then things like that happen. <clears throat> We're gonna pretend like that that never happened. So you're gonna continue uh, right this way. Yep, there's one hiding right here. We'll go ahead and say hi to that guy. Pick him up. We'll back ourselves out. And we got our last one over here. Those are gonna be your pickup spots. Now, what you're gonna do... I like to just go over here. What you're gonna chill here. What you're gonna do is, um, first off, you want to be in a private or a solo game. That way, um, the items are bound to you and not someone else. Uh, and then you're gonna go ahead and uh, you're actually gonna exit and go to main menu, and you're gonna come right back in. Now, when you come back in, you're gonna start exactly where you were. You're going to start the cycle all over again until you get everything you need. So those medical containers that a lot of people are looking for, they're usually going to be in this area. Possibly one back there. There's one over here. But you'll also see it on the map that I'm going to show you guys. Don't forget about the uh, thrusters on your SRV. Have a little fun with them. But besides that, when you are done... Just bring your nice, uh, nice little SRV back over to your ship. Wait for it to say board ship. And go ahead and board your ship. Pull you right in. The wing, or the uh, wheels go in, which is. I think pretty cool. It's a really cool idea. Can't wait till we get space legs. And then you're back at it. So that's just a brief, uh, quick overlook of Dave's of Dav's hope and the things that you can find here, how to do it, where to find it, and what to bring with you, and any other knowledge. Any questions? Leave them down in the comments. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. It is free. Uh, hit that like button. 
let me know what you guys think down in the comments, as always, like I said. And I will see you guys in the next episode. We should be covering either engineers or something else miscellaneous someone might bring up. Who knows? But I should be uploading Elite Dangerous every other day to three days, depending. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching, as always. And I will see you guys in the next one. 07 Commanders.